this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. And another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. Today in this video I am being joined by not one, not two, but three people. And here they are! Oh, well here's one. <laughs> here's Lee, he's put down another door. You look, you look swishy out there, you put an extra door on. <laughs> I'm being joined by Lee Bear. I am being joined by Squishy Quack. And I'm also being joined by... Choo Choo! There we go, just about managed to fit through the door as always. Good morning everybody! And there's no way to say good morning better than eating a... cake! Nom 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 nom! There we go, good morning everyone, good morning! And let's hop outside and do the hop and splash! And I keep getting so, 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 so close with this, but I keep just about failing. So, uh, Lee, you've already done it, but you can go again if you want to show us all how to do it. Alright, let's all go quickly, let's all do it in a big conveyor belt. All one after the other, right? There's Lee down, I'm gonna go next, Squashy and Choo Choo, you can follow behind me, and oop, oh, I'm down again already, not a good go for me. Okay, Squashy, you're up and oh that's a good first jump oh choo choo's with her <laughs> see if you can do it at the same time oh no that squishy dropped down it's all on you choo choo can you redeem us all can you save the day nope he's dropped down as well oh well it doesn't matter i'm not too worried about that today because i'm looking forward to playing a different game in my fun land and all will be revealed soon uh, but first to my love garden i want to add uh let's see if i can say this right Dan Joe bro and uh, that is because of an amazing animation uh, that he sent me he made an animation of a funny moment uh, from one of me and squid's let's plays and uh, it was absolutely amazing it was hilarious and uh, I'll leave it as a link in the description if you want to check it out and uh, he's hopefully going to do a few more as well so uh, I'll share them with you uh, if he does uh, so I wanted to say thank you very much for making the video and welcome to my love garden anyway everyone let's go 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 to the fun land where we are going to play a whale of a time and hopefully have a whale of a time doing it and uh, it's a new mini game uh, I was building it in the last couple episodes so there's a good chance you've seen it uh, if not I will explain the rules when we get over there but first I am going to go and choose which dog uh, is going to be joining me today and let's be joined by Corey today uh, let's have Corey join me are you Corey you are not Corey but you are you are Corey and therefore you can join me and are you, are you going to attack anyone or are you being friendly actually listen everyone quiet everyone listen for a second can you hear that no growling my dogs aren't growling. My dogs are finally happy again. <laughs> oh dear, my dogs went through a very, very grumpy stage and they were barking and moaning and being angry at everyone, but they seem to have finally cheered up. And where did those... Where did those arrows come from? Anyway, let's all try and get over to the fun land as quick as we can because we also uh, want to sleep uh, before we start the game because it is a rather dangerous game. And let's uh, explain what it is uh, just in case uh, you haven't seen the last couple episodes. So I've built a big killer well. I've built a big orca and you go inside the orca and inside of it is a player launcher. You press a button and you're fired by TNT out of the blowhole of the orca. You then fly through the air and try and land through a coloured hoop. And the coloured hoop you have to land in uh, is determined uh, by which coloured piece of wool uh, you get from a dispenser. And so the way we're going to do the tournament is basically it's going to be quite tough rules. If you ever miss a hoop or don't land through the colour you're supposed to, you are out. So we're basically going to keep taking it in turns, having a go, being fired into the air until there's only one person left. And uh, whoever the one person left is, is going to win and then pick another game in my fun land uh, for us all to play afterwards. So uh, you can't muck up. Only one mistake will kick you out of the tournament. So the stakes and us <laughs> are going to be very high in this video. <laughs> uh, but as I said, it is a rather dangerous game. Uh, so it's probably going to be a good idea to, to sleep before we start. So I have put down some uh, some beds down here. Uh, you'll also see that I've decided to, to light up the entire game. Uh, I've put torches all over it. So uh, even if it does get dark, uh, we should be able to see where we're doing. So what time is it? There we go. The sun is just about beginning to go down. So Corey, uh, you can sit down here because I've not tested it with dogs. I could test it with dogs, but I'm a little bit scared too. It should be safe. It should be as safe for dogs as it is for us. But the problem is it's not very safe for us. So <laughs> I'd rather not do it. So as you can see, it's all set up and uh, ready to go. Uh, the hoops are all in position. Uh, we've also 
dug down the lake a little bit deeper. You may remember uh, that in the last episode that it wasn't deep enough, and so we'd fly up fine and we'd land in the hoop fine, but then we'd die as we hit the ground. So we had to go down and dig out the entire lake that took ages. <laughs> uh, but now it should be uh, a little bit safer. So the sun is beginning to set. Uh, so does everyone want to join me over at the beds? And we can all have a, a sleep and set our spawn. And then in the morning we can we can go first. So you're not you're not supposed to sleep down here. <laughs> I know I know. Squash always likes to go into the water because she's a duck. I'm not sure why you are right. Is it bedtime? Come on. Come on. Let us sleep. Let us sleep. Come on, please. I'm really tired. I promise I'm really tired. I want to sleep. <laughs> why can't they let you nap in the day? That's something that they should add to Minecraft. They should add the uh, the ability uh, for an afternoon nap. I think that would be <laughs> I think that would be lovely. There we go. We can all now uh, finally go to sleep. And in the morning, as I said, we're going to take it in terms of being fired into the air uh, until there's only uh, one person left. So who wants to go first? Liebe, as uh, seen as you're next to the dispenser, do you want to have the honours of being the first person to have a whale of a time? So whenever you're ready, go and press the button and see what colour. It's a, it's a yellow one. Lee needs to go and land in a yellow hoop. So I'm just going to go run over here uh, so I can get a, a good view. And uh, let's see whether he's going to be able to land in the, in the, the yellow hoop. I'm actually... Uh, pile up a, a little bit here and then that way I'm going to be able to get a good view and there he goes there he goes he is off he is up he is high he's in the sky and yay no problems from Lee Bear well done you had all of the pressure on your shoulders but you didn't disappoint so there we go Lee is safe Lee is still in so Squishy you can go next uh, your turn to press the button and uh, see what colour you're going to get. Oh, don't run away yet, Squishy. Don't run away yet. You need to go and press the button and see what uh, what colour you're going to get before you get launched. Uh, so let me go and uh, get rid of uh, Lee's wall. And uh, I'm just going to go and put that back inside here. And Squishy, oh, I didn't see what colour she got. She's got magenta. Squishy has to do magenta. Okay, take it away, Squishy. Take it away. I'm going to go uh, back up here. I'm going to build a, a little perch just so I can easily see what colour they, um, uh, they're landing in. If I go and build up one more here as well, uh, then that way I can look down a little bit more. There we go. Now I got a good view. And oh, she's fired. She's fired. Is she up in the air? I can't even see. Did she get launched? I think she might have gone so quick that I couldn't see her. Either that or she's still inside. I think she might actually be still inside. I think she might have missed. The rule is, um, if you... um. If you don't actually get out of the well, uh, then you're allowed another go, Squishy. So that was just uh, a misfire. So uh, you can have uh, another go. There we go. Choo Choo's uh, setting it up for you again there, Squishy. So if you don't actually make it out of the blowhole, uh, you are allowed another go. Just make sure you stay right at the front in the middle and you should be able to, to fit through. It's only uh, a one block wide hole that you can get through. Uh, so it is a, a little bit difficult. So uh, whenever you're ready, Squishy, have attempt number two. And oh, did she, did she make it out? I don't think she... I don't think she made it out again this time. She's having a little bit of trouble. So uh, let me just go and explain how to do it again. We did have a little test to go uh, before we started. So after you press the button, Squishy, just try and stay right in the middle and just hold forward and keep uh, pressing A. Uh, just keep holding down A and bobbing up and down and you should be able to launch. And there we go. I heard a sizzle. I heard a sizzle of the TNT and there we go. No problem this time as she goes sky high. And is she going to land in the magenta one? She hasn't landed yet. No! Oh, so close! She hit the rim. She hit the rim of the magenta one. She was just one block out. That's very unfortunate for Squishy to be out on her first go. But the game must sadly carry on. And oh no! She's lost all of her, her armor as well. You can go grab that if you want, Squishy. But now... It's Choo Choo's go. So Choo Choo, take it away, press the button, and uh, we can see which colour you're going to have to go for. He has to go for yellow as well, and it worked for Lee. Lee did a good job going for yellow, so let's see if it's going to go and work for Choo Choo. So whenever you're ready, uh, press the button and get fired in the air. There's a... Uh, there's Three, no, there's uh, five different yellow ones he could land in. Which one's he going to go for? Well, he's been in the air for a long time. He must have got some really good height. I can't see where he's landing. Did he even... Did he even get in the air? I think he might have had a, another misfire. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so uh, set it up again, Choo Choo, and have another go. And there we go. That one wasn't a misfire. He is very, very high. You can see him there trying to guide himself. And there we go. No problems for Choo Choo. Straight in the yellow one. And you know what this means? Everyone's had a go apart from me, so it's my turn uh, to go and see if I can do it. Let's go and uh, go and put this magenta wall back in, and uh, let's go and press the button, and it's red. We haven't had red yet, so let me go put this in. Let's see if I can land in a red one. Lee's there keeping guard. Right, where's a good red one? 
Hmm. I think I find it easier to go for some of the ones further back. So I might just go in the air and just try and just see whether it works. See if I can just go and try and guide myself. I've not done this in a while though. And here we go. That is very, very high. I'm going for the one on the back row. The furthest row. This is looking good. This is looking good. This is looking good. That was perfect. No problems for Stampy Cat, which means it's your go again, Lee. Go and press the button. And I uh, will see which colour you have to do next. I'm going to go and try and run my way back. Uh, don't go until I've seen which colour you need to land in though, Lee. Oh, I think he's there just setting up the TNT. Okay, press the button when you're ready. And uh, let's see what colour you're going to have to go for your next one. Another yellow one. Yellow seems to be a popular choice. Well, it worked for you in the first time, Lee. So let's see if it's going to work this time. Just do exactly what you did the first time. So I'm going to go get in position. Whenever you're ready, Lee, go and press the button and get launched. And there he goes. <laughs> that wasn't a misfire. Whoa, you did flew into the sun there Lee look how high he's gone he's a little tiny speck and there we go straight in the yellow looking very confident there looking very confident okay Choo Choo it's now over to you it seems like all three of us are doing very well looks like the TNT is all set up so do you want to go and uh, press the button oh he's got some ender pearls to get back quickly <gasps> Uh oh! Alarm bells! Uh oh! <laughs> Choo Choo has to go for the black one. And if you don't know, the black one is by far the hardest one. There's only one. There's only one black one, and it is right in the middle at the very back. Look how far away it is. It's by far the toughest one to get, so good luck, Choo Choo. You are honestly gonna need it. Press the button whenever you're ready and see how far you can get. Can you get far enough to get into the black one? And oh no! Oh no! It was a misfire! He got outside of the well, but he hit the fin. I think he tried to hold forward too much and he hit the fin. Oh, what a shame. What a shame. He wasn't able to get the black one. That's why it's the toughest one, which means it's now between just me and Lee. So if either of us lose, then the other person is going to be the victor. And it's my go, I believe. It's, this is one of the games where I don't want it to be my go, because when it's my go, it means there's a chance I'm going to lose. And I got a red one again. Okay, I'm going to try and go from a, for a, a different red one, a uh, red one, uh, a red one than I went for last time, just for a, a bit of variety. But at least I know I can get red. I keep getting red, and Lee keeps getting yellow. So it looks like they're our favourite colours. Right, I'm going to go for this one on the far right if I can. This is looking okay. Can I guide it in? Ooh, that was quite close. <laughs> that was closer than the last one. I managed to do it, though. I managed to do it. Okay, Lee, get all of your, your TNT set up. Let's see if you can be a bit more exciting and pick a different colour other than yellow this time. <laughs> oh, I know you have absolutely no choice. And no, it's yellow again. What are the chances? What are the chances? I promise you, look, there's the same amount of every colour in there. Lee just keeps getting yellow. I guess that's just what he's best at. So um, once again, Lee, just try and do exactly the same as you did all of the other goes, I guess. Press the button whenever you're ready and uh, see if you can get yellow for the third time in a row. And oh no, oh no. Okay, it was a misfire. He didn't get off the well though. So you can have another go, Lee. You can have another go. You've got to be very careful though when you um when you fire. Don't hold forward too much. Otherwise, I think you just hit the uh, the top of the uh, of the fin there. But because he was still on the well and uh, didn't land in the water, uh, I'm gonna let him have a have another go. So uh, once the uh, the TNT is all set up and in position, Lee, uh, feel free to to press the button again and uh, see if you can once again uh, land inside one of the yellow hoops. And there he goes. I thought it was a misfire at first, but no, he's just gone straight up. He's hardly gone forward at all. He's guiding himself though. He's going for a different one. And there we go. He managed to get it. Well done, Lee. Well done, Lee. He got another yellow one that certainly seems to be his speciality so let's see if I am going to get a different color other than red this time and oh look they've given Corey a cake <laughs> it's nice to see Choo Choo and Squishy keeping my dog entertained anyway we're in the middle of a game and no I got red again what are the chances right my challenge then is to, to every time try and go for a different red hoop. Seeing as I keep getting the same colour, I might as well try and be a little bit exciting and see if I can get another red hoop. Thanks for setting up the uh, the TNT for me, Lee. And uh, let me go inside here. So I don't want to go as far forward this time, so I'm going to go for a different red one. Let's try not to get a misfire. And here we go. This is good. Right, I'm going to go to the left and try and go for this one on the far left on the third row. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? Ooh, just about. Just about. Okay, so Lee, it's your go now. Let's see if he's going to go and get another yellow one. And uh, what we're actually going to do is if uh, we both keep trying to get it and we both keep getting it fine, we're going to add another rule where you can actually set what row uh, the other person has to try and get to make it even more difficult. Uh, but we'll see how this goes. And oh, I think Choo Choo picked up the uh, the block there. you got to stand back a little bit. Uh, what colour was it? Did Choo Choo, did you pick it up or did Squishy, did someone pick it up? Nope. Uh, oh, it's yellow. Really? 
It was really yellow again, Choo Choo. You should have lied and said a different colour right then. <laughs> what are the chances of this? <laughs> How has he got yellow this many times in a row? Oh, well, I guess he's going to keep getting yellow until he eventually makes the mistake, I guess. Right, I'm ready, Lee. I got a good view. Whenever you're ready, press the button, fire into the sky, and try and get the yellow. I think he's going for one, uh, one of the ones on the far left this time, by the looks of it. I oh, know he's going for the middle one, and he got it. And he did manage to get it. So I'm going to have one more go uh, doing it normally. And uh, if I uh, manage to make this, I'm going to add the extra rule of trying to, to set it uh, so you can choose which uh, row the other person has to get. Do you want to stand back a little bit, Choo Choo? Uh, otherwise, you're going to keep uh, picking up the uh, the blocks as we press the button. And i got to get black. <gasps> Uh-oh! It didn't go well for Choo Choo. Is it going to go better for me? To be honest, I'm just glad to get something other than red for once. <laughs> Right, okay, let's do it. I don't want to hold forward too much, because otherwise I'm going to go and do what Choo Choo did, and that wouldn't be good. But I do need to get as far forward as I can. And there we go. That was a good launch. That was a good, solid launch. I got some good distance there. But is it far enough? Is it far enough? It might be. It might be. It is! I managed to do it. I managed to land in the black. Whew. I wasn't sure if I was then. <laughs> I only just about had to make it. I was leaning forward as far as I could as I flew through the sky there. But I managed to do it. I just about managed to do it. So, Lee... Hold your horses, because now I get to pick which row you have to go for. So feel free to press the button, but then I'm going to put down a sign and tell you which one. Actually, I can tell you. Yellow! <laughs> Yellow again, Lee! <laughs> what are the chances? That's unbelievable. Okay, you have to go for row number one. Okay, so that's the first row, the row nearest to the orca. You can only land in that yellow hoop, otherwise you fail. And I'll give you a clue, Lee, uh, it's on the far left, so just so you know what you're aiming for. So the first row, far left, the yellow hoop. If you land anywhere other than that yellow hoop, then I am going to win. Lee must be really feeling the pressure now. And he's launched. He's high in the sky. He's going in the right direction, though. That was good. That was good. He's gone really far over to the left. Is he far back enough, though? I don't think he is. No! He hit the edge of the hoop. He hit the edge of the hoop, which means I am the winner! And I did have a whale of a time. <laughs> Oh, that game is really good fun. <laughs> oh, dear. So sorry uh, to Squishy, Choo Choo and Lee for winning. It was really close in the end uh, between me and Lee. Uh, but this means that I get to pick whichever game we play next. Uh, so let's all uh, go over to, to, to have a sleep again. And then in the morning, I'm going to decide which game to play. Uh, let, me have a, let me have a little look around and think about what would I like to do. We've got the, uh, the Helter Skelter, the Pew Pew shooting range. I actually... Fancy having a go on Sharky Shark, because I did very bad at Sharky Shark last time, so I fancy uh, having another go on Sharky Shark. So let's, let's, let's not worry about going to sleep. Uh, let's just go and play it anyway. We can stay up all night, and uh, Corey, uh, you can come and join me. I just want to make sure that you don't uh, run. Actually, let's just have Corey running around. It just might make the game even more fun. So I'm going to go on the, the orange side, and uh, we can have a, a 2v2 game here, I guess. We can have two of us against another two of us. So I think it's going to be me and Choo Choo. Uh, against Squashy and Lee on the green side. So uh, the way you play this game is uh, you grab some fishing rods and you need to flick the uh, the shark, also known as a minecart, in your direction. And the first person to get it onto their boat is going to be the winner. And it's as simple as that. So everyone seems to be in position. Let's begin playing Sharky Shark in a three, two, one. Flick the sharks. You need to try and grab it as much as you can, and it's going to be crazy. I've never done this with this many people playing. Ah, it seems to have got shark. Oh no, they pulled it. They pulled it in their direction. We need to get it back. There we go. I got it back to the middle. Oh no, it got stopped. Oh, Lee actually helped us there. Okay, it's on your side now, Choo Choo. We're all after you. Choo Choo's doing great as well. Look how far it's going. Can we get it all the way to the end? Oh no, it's just stopped. It's just stopped. Can we pull it back? One more big pull. And we've done it! We've done it! We got the shark! <laughs> right, let's do it. Let's do a best out of three then. Let's do a best out of three because we have time. Right, I'm placing the shark back in the middle. And so the way the best out of three works, if me and Choo Choo win now, we are the overall winners. If Lee and Squashy win, then we go to a decider. So let's begin. In three, two, one, fish the shark. And look at them all going. Look at all of the fishing rods going. I think me and Choo Choo got the better out of that one, but they're pulling it straight back again. But no, Choo Choo managed to grab it. Choo Choo is amazing at this game. I'm doing nothing here. He's doing all of the work. Can I try and stop it? 
It's sometimes a good idea just to leave your fishing rod on the track and even if you don't pull it back you can kind of block it but they're doing really well. Let me try and block it. There we go. I was able to block it but oh no they've got it right to the end. They've got it right to the end. We need to stop it. We need to pull it back. There we go. It's going back our way. Can I grab it? There we go. I got a good grab there. Right. It's all on you now Choo Choo. Carry on. Keep the momentum. Keep the momentum. There we go. We've got it back to the middle at least. We've got it back to the middle and now it's going over to our side. Two more good pulls and we can win this. There we go. Here we go. One more big pull and then another one. Can we get it? This is it. This is it. There we go. We were able to win. <laughs> Yay. Whale of a time and Sharky Shark champion. Whoop, 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 whoop. And we can have a floating cake to celebrate. Well, I'm not actually very hungry, so we're just going to look at the cake instead. Ah, oh dear. Anyway, that is the end of this episode here. Hopefully you enjoyed us playing uh, all of these mini games. Uh, in my next episode, I'm going to go and build something brand new. Uh, so make sure you come back to check that out. But for now, I want to say a big thank you to Squishy Choo Choo and Lee for joining me and being such good sports. A uh, big thank you to Corey as well for joining me and uh, being so patient watching. <laughs> and of course, a very big thank you to all of you watching at home. And I'll see you all later. Bye!